we focused on failure in terms of command failure, when the president uses prerogative powers and fails either in justifying the, their authority or their legitimacy. However, not all failure is command failure. The president can fail when working with Congress or even just politically. They can do something that ultimately um, fails to persuade the public. So, right, we know that the president's power, at least according to Newstat, is the power to persuade. So, commands, prerogatives can fail, but so can persuasion. And um, George H.W. Bush experienced this in his reelection. He, during his first election, promised no new taxes. And he was unable to keep that promise. And there were many good reasons why he raised taxes. However, he was so emphatic in his promise and then sort of very flippant in explaining why he had to break the promise that the public ultimately was not persuaded by this and felt that he had not met their expectations. Now, Clinton attempted to work with Congress as well. You know, Bush worked with Congress to raise taxes. Clinton worked with Congress in this case to pass new health care legislation. But in this case, it wasn't a public a failure to convince the public to go along with it. He failed to persuade Congress to go along with it. And ultimately, this health care deal that he'd worked out never got passed into law.